Hey guys, I hope you're having a smashing day. Um, here is finally the um, Fortnite Note Blocks uh, tutorial uh, for Billie Eilish's song Ocean Eyes. Um, I've had a few requests for it and I've been struggling to try and find out a way of how to go about doing a tutorial whether to create a whole new sequence or to just run through this one step by step um i think i'm gonna, just gonna try and run through this one step by step and show you the notes and show you, oh god i'm not very good at landing oh my god i've done it again all right let me try again yeah, so I'm going to just go through the notes and the placements on these blocks and show you how I went about making it. Um, so yeah, I hope you enjoy it and I hope you find it helpful. Right, so first thing I did of how to know what notes to put in it is I just went on YouTube and I just searched in a piano tutorial for the song. For Billie Eilish Ocean Eyes. I just searched in a tutorial and that's how I found out what notes to use. Um, I'm actually going to play the song right now for you so you can hear once again what it sounds like. So. Okay, so that's the song once again, just so you can hear it, you know, fresh and in your memory and stuff. Um, it was, uh, I chose a very hard song to do um, because there's a lot of gaps in between the music. So in between like each line, there's a massive chunk missing. So I found it very hard to try and find the right placement to like, do you know place the notes um it's not a hundred percent correct the like spaces in between but it's pretty much there and i could not get it any closer um so it took me a very long time to try and figure out how to do it but what i did was you see the blocks i've used for the walls and the floor so on the floor you can see that it's got lines where the block ends i used those lines as my guide to start each line as you can see there's the start of a line and start there you go start again there and again there so that's how i worked out my spacings and then in between each of oh for god's sake let me try again in between each of these notes i believe there's three kind of gaps of the notes in between them so that's how i went about placing all the blocks it took me a while and i also had to decide what to use um which one of these to use and obviously i went with the piano chords because it just you know makes more sense it's a piano song well kind of um so i just went with piano oh my god i cannot land I severely apologize. Let me try again. All right. So now I'm going to run through the notes for you and I will write them in the description below as well. So, you know, um, I think we need to turn around this way. Yeah. Okay. So this is for the verse. I just do one verse and then I head into the chorus and that was, that was what I did. Um, so let's go through it now. So at the start of the line, at the start of the block, We've got E on the, let's go from this way. We've got E on the right and C on the left. Sounds like that. And then three kind of spaces forward. We have a D and a D. One is higher and one is lower. So I'll put the lower one on the left. Left is the low side and right is the highest side. You'd know if you play piano. 
and then three blocks forward from that is B and E and that sounds like this and then another I think it's three here or it might be four here we've got A and then G and as you can see how I've lined up with the blocks there so you've got a line start of the like block panel there and then you've got another start there then you've got that and then this is the next line so we have again E and C and then the double D and then B and E and then this one we have a bigger gap um, between these lines you've got a couple of uh, a couple of like melody notes so you go so that goes with the watching you line I'm not gonna sing it because I don't really fancy singing right now but it goes with the watching you I think it's watching you let me just sing in my head quickly it's the chin you part that the a and the uh, what is that a G goes with yeah um, and then with this line you don't have anything don't have any of the melody notes to do um, so it's just for some time like that and then you've got the E and the C again and then the double D again and the B and the E again and then you've got the A G A and then you've got the you got B and G D and D again and G and E right so I'm gonna talk the lyrics so you kind of know but I don't want really want to sing I've been watching you that was completely out of time should I sing no nah, I don't really fancy it chin you like that for some time um, what, what's the lyrics now? I've forgotten them. <laughs> Can't stop staring at those. So you've got the at those ocean eyes. That was pretty crap, but I don't really want to sing. <laughs> I don't really sound very good right now. So anyway, B and the G there, double D and G and E. Right, so that is the verse. Let me just run over that once again very quickly. So right, we've got the start of the block here and we've got the E and the C. Then we've got the double D. Then you've got about three spaces in between. You've got the B and the E. Then you've got the A on the edge of the next block and then you've got G. And then at the start of the next block, you've got the E and the C again, double D, uh, B and the E. And then you've got big gap, start of the next, next block. You've got E and C, D and D, B and E, and A, G, A, and start of that next block after that is B and G, double D, G and E. Okay, so that is the verse. You can play that over, over and over again, because you know it's on a video, so you can just play it however long you want to for and stuff, so yeah. Right, so that's the verse. Now we're on to the chorus. This spacing took me a while. Um, so right, we've ended that on, say, this is block one, we'll just say. Then you got two here, and then you start it on the third one along. So you've got the B, G, C, which is like in the right in the middle of one of the block lines. And then you've got D, E on the edge of the next block. Then you've got a bit of a gap. And then you've got E, G, A and C, G right next to each other like that. And you've got the line like in between the four of them like that. Okay, so A, G, A, C and G. And then you have one space in between. And you've got D. And then I believe that's two spaces after the line is E. Then you go a little bit forward, you've got one line of the block in between, and then you've got E, pretty much in the centre, slightly up from the centre of the block. Oh, this is taking a while. Um, it's, very, it's really hard to explain. 
Um, I don't want to. I didn't want to try and recreate it because I feel like it would take me too long to do that, and I'd confuse you even more. And by doing it this way, you could play it over and over again, and get the spacings right. You can pause it. You can do whatever you want with it, and make sure you get the notes in the right place. So that's why I'm doing it this way because I feel like you can pause it and just it's a lot easier for you if you want to recreate this. Anyways, let's carry on. Um, so after that E, we want to go here to the next block. You've got the B and the low C, low D, A. So basically all the ones on the left, right, they're all low octave. They're a low octave. And all the high ones, they're like middle C or above. Um, and then you've got a line in between here. And then you've got G and E. And then you've got a bit of a gap. And then after the next line after that, you've got E, G, A. Like that. E, G, A. And then you've got B and G. Double D on the next line. And double E. Okay. And then after that, you've got one whole block in between. And then you go on to A, B and low G, double D, and double E. That's it, pretty much. So should we go through that chorus again? Where does it start? Where does it start? I want to say here. Yeah. B, G... C, D, E. Let's go like this. Oh, this might be easier. Then you got that gap. Then you got A, G, A, C, G, D, E. Then you got a gap. Then you got E, B. C on the next line, and you got D and A, then you got a couple of lines up from the block line. I'm making no sense. Um, then you got G, is that G? Yeah, I want to say G. Yeah, it's G. Is that G? Yeah, it's G. The G and the C look so similar, I swear. And then you got G and E, then you got E, G, A on the next line. B and G, and then on the next line you've got double D, and then you've got double D, double, double D, double D and double E, sorry, losing it, a uh, bit further on, and you've got A on the next line, B, G, double D, and double E. So that's it, I mean it's pretty simple. Um, the only, the only problem I had was just literally the spacing in between, the timings of it all. So that's why I use these blocks here. Um, where do I find them? Let me show you where you find them. Uh, I don't know how to work this. Let's go inventory. Um, 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 which one is it in? Which one is it in? I don't know, I can't see it. Um, I actually can't see it. What is all of this? Blimey, Romy. They've added a lot since I last looked on here. They've got lava and all sorts. Fireworks? Particles. What's that? Minecarts. Blimey, Romy. They have added a lot. Oh my god. Blimey. Alright, okay, they're doing quite well. That is quite a lot of stuff. I think it's this one. No, it's not that one. Where is it? Bear with me. I will get there eventually. I will find it. Bear with me. 
Have I not got it on the floor anywhere? No, I don't. What is it? Let's do some copying. Ah, oh, I used the wrong button. That's oh, right. Alright. Alright, so that's what it looks like. Alright, I'm just going to try and find it again. This is frustrating me now. I do not know where it is. I want to say it's in this one. No, it's not. I do apologise. I swear it is here somewhere. I mean, it obviously is. It's not that one. It obviously is because, you know, I used it for it. Uh, what is this? Fine. Infinity Blade. Let's try this one. Let's fly away. And let's give it a place. Are you actually kidding me? Why why does it hate me? Why just why does it hate me? There you go. Here it is. Okay, this is it. Okay, it looks exactly the same as that. This is it. So this is the prefab, the gallery thing it's in. Um, it's among all the Tokyo stuff. Looks like Tokyo anyway, I swear. Um, so this is it just here. It's like pretty near the bottom. And you can find it in that. Um, so that's what it looks like. And that's what I used to get the spacings because it was just really hard. So that is the bottom of it. Um, so yeah, I don't really know much else to say to be honest. Now I've shown you the notes, you can just run through this video again and again, however long it takes you. Um, pause. Um, so just like go through the first line and pause it, do it all and you know, go through it like that. So. Anyway, I hope this video helped you out for those who requested it. Sorry it took me so long to get it done. I was just trying to figure out how I was going to go about doing it. Um, but I hope this helped you and I hope you recreate this because it is a great song. Um, so yeah, thank you so much for watching. Um, if you enjoyed it and it helped you, then drop it a th thumbs up and be sure to subscribe to my channel as well so you don't miss any more of my videos um if you want to see other note block recreations then just drop an idea down below and i will try and recreate it for you um so yeah uh thank you so much for watching and i hope to see you in my next video and i hope that you leave a request for another one as well um yeah see you later Oh, 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 oh,